friends welcome to ctc today i'll show you how to get an input from user through keyboard in the previous tutorial we just printed the information on the output screen so this is the previous example which we use from now i am going to use uh, eclipse ide it will so it will not take much time to demonstrate the program so this was the program which we wrote in notepad plus plus so now what we have to do is just remove this there is a class in java called scanner class which is used to take input from user through keyboard so we need to create a variable of scanner class for that we have to type scanner and we need a variable name this is the variable name reader and uh, to create an object of scanner class we use keyword new and then name of that class here we have to pass system dot in system is a class and dot in is a static variable of uh, input stream type input stream is also a class and in is a static variable which is declared in this system class that is standard input stream now it shows the error cannot be resolved scanner cannot be resolved to a type compiler doesn't know what this scanner is so we have to import this scanner class type import keyword then java dot util dot scanner since scanner class reside in util package java dot util package we have to import that class to utilize here so now we have created a variable named reader which uh, refers to the object of type scanner and we are going to use that object to get an input from user through keyboard so first we will enter enter name now if user enters a name we need to store that information somewhere you know variable since in the where what is field and method and class in that tutorial i have explained theoretical part what variable variable is nothing but a storage unit that store the information so now we have to store name somewhere so we need to create a variable of type string and we also want to get a gender of that user person and we want to take age also so for that age will be in a number so we need to declare it in data type and name and gender will be in a string format so we want user to enter name so this information will be printed on the screen you might have seen in the previous program so here we need to store that value in name so reader dot next line is a method which moves to the next line skip the current line and moves to the next line and returns the previous line so it reads the entire line until it, until it encounters to the separator now the information that is name when user enters name that name will be stored in this name variable same way we have to take gender from user enter gender and same again we just have to store the information in the gender variable again we have to take age since age is a number that is int type we have another method that is next int use this method it will search for the next token that has to be number if you type uh, care or if you type string something like that then it will give 
error runtime error now we have taken all the information from user through keyboard and we want to print that information on the output screen so as you know in previous video tutorial I shown you how to print so now we have to use plus operator to concatenate name string string return name and name the information stored in the name variable same way just paste and paste gender here type gender because this variable will have information regarding gender of person and then here age type age now run this program you can see here now we will type name say James Gosling press enter it's asking for gender male press enter now it is asking for age 61 and once you enter it will go to this line and it will execute these lines means it will print the information which we took from user see James Gosling gender male 61 so this way you can uh, get an input from user and uh, print that information on the screen I hope this video was helpful to you please check out my other videos too and don't forget to like share subscribe for more videos it makes huge difference thank you